Hello and welcome to Little Garden on the Prairies. So in today's video we are going to take a look at my container corn crop here. So you can see it's coming along really nicely. We are at the end of July and this corn crop is getting ready for pollination. So as you can see there's a bunch of tassels coming up through the corn here. So what needs to happen here to um, get a good corn crop is all the pollen found in these little tassels here needs to land on the silks of these cobs and from there that will produce a good ear of corn. So the natural way for corn to be pollinated is with wind, uh, usually in big fields of corn that works really well. But in a small garden like this sometimes the chances of the wind blowing the right direction and having the pollen fall off these tassels and land on the silks doesn't always happen. So I'm going to just show you a little trick that I'm going to try here to help ensure good pollination of my corn crop and then we will come back in a couple weeks and see how it turns out. So as you can see here on these tassels there's a bunch of tiny little purple uh, flakes here and this is kind of what is where the pollen can be found. So I'm just going to shake a bunch of it onto this piece of paper here. You can just use paper or newspaper. Get a good bunch of it going here. And then from there you just walk around, look for your corn silks. And you want to try and catch this within 10 days of you know the silk showing up and try to make sure you get a nice good pollination going. I'm just going to shake a bunch of these right into the silks. And I'm just going to keep doing this all around my corn plant. You can also cut, you know, little pieces of these tassels off and walk around and rub them. I'm just going to do it this way. It's pretty easy to shake it off right onto a piece of paper. So I will just continue doing this over the next week or so. I'll keep an eye out for new silks that appear on the corn here and just walk around, pick up some of these little pieces of pollen from the tassel and just keep helping it along. So if you're growing corn in a small area like I am here in the garden, I recommend giving this little trick a try to help with pollination. I will be uh, doing an update video next month just to let you know how this worked out. So 
please don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on future videos coming to the channel. Thank you for watching and happy gardening.